As COVID cases continue to surge, especially among young and middle-aged adults in Minnesota, the Department of Health released a sobering outlier today. 46 people died in the last day from COVID-19, deaths occurring in 29 different counties. One of them, a 21-year-old from Clay County, reportedly with no underlying health conditions. It is um, not, not typical, but we need people to understand that just um, younger age uh, and even um, health condition is, is not a guarantee that, that folks are not very vulnerable. It's a tragic outcome, and, and our, our hearts go out to this, to this and all families. Governor Walls noted the now exponential trajectory of cases. It took seven months to reach 100,000, seven weeks to reach 200,000. U of M infectious diseases expert Dr. Michael Osterholm also on the call today saying nationally cases are set to explode as well. As the governor noted, we're in a period now of exponential growth, a period where we could expect to see these cases go much higher than they are today. And I would just, my best professional judgment is that we could easily be well into the mid to high 200,000s of cases a day, literally within the next month, if there aren't changes made. We are approaching what Osterholm called the darkest days of the pandemic. Chris Arapsky, CARE 11 News. Dr. Osterholm also sat down with CARE 11's Kent Erdahl earlier today for an extended interview. Tonight at 630, his thoughts on getting through the rest of the winter, the dire situation facing frontline workers, and helping those who have lost wages and businesses.